Welcome to Molescope. Here's a quick guide on imaging your lesions and sending them to your healthcare provider for fast and effective care. In your email inbox, you may have noticed that you've been invited to verify your Molescope account. Simply click Verify Account and complete the fields with your information and create a secure password. Be sure to download the free Molescope app and log in with your credentials. Let's get started with imaging. To add a spot, press the mole box icon. You can easily navigate the 3D body map with just a few taps. To zoom in and out on the map, use two fingers to pinch the screen. To rotate the view, tap and drag the body map with one finger. Finally, you can pan around the screen by tapping and dragging with two fingers. A quick tip, tap a body part icon to automatically focus on that area to make the spot easier to place. Tap once to add the spot. If you wish to adjust the placement, simply tap another area to move it. Then hit next. Let's start by adding the overview image. Make sure you're in a well-lit area. Select the overview icon and position yourself to take the image. Tap the screen to help focus the camera. When ready, take the image by pressing the camera icon. You have the option to crop your image as well. Once you're happy with the image, tap the check mark to save. We recommend taking two overview images, one close-up overview image that is 15 centimeters away from the skin, and one further back to make visible where the lesion is on the body. To add additional overviews, tap overview again and then press on the add photo button. Continue imaging by repeating the same process. To view these images, simply press on the overview image. Next. Let's take a dermoscopic image. Tap the Molescope icon in the bottom right corner. Gently attach the Molescope device to your phone. There is no need to use heavy pressure. Slide the device until it fully covers your phone's camera and turn on the light. Depending on your phone, the Molescope will either slide down or to the right to fit to the camera. Though optional, we recommend applying a drop of fluid such as rubbing alcohol, disinfectant gel, or oil to your lesion as you image. Press the contact plate firmly to the skin to get a clear image. It is crucial that you tap the screen to focus the camera on the lesion and then hold steady as you image. Once ready, press the camera icon to take the image. To add additional dermoscopic images, simply press the Molescope icon again and continue imaging by repeating the same process. To view these images, simply press on the set of dermoscopic images. Please do not send a blurry image because it will increase wait times and be unusable by the clinical team. There are a few common mistakes to be avoided when taking dermoscopic images. Here are some quick examples. The phone camera lens or Molescope lens is dirty and the resulting image is blurry. The Molescope is fitted improperly to the phone and the lenses don't line up. The Molescope contact cap is not contacting the skin. Additionally, it is also a problem if the contact cap is pressed too hard onto the skin. Simply rest the contact cap on the skin and ensure it fully touches the lesion. If you're using fluids such as gels or rubbing alcohol, make sure that there are no bubbles over the lesion that will make it difficult to see. In this example, the skin is too dry. The screen has not been tapped and thus the camera is not focused on the lesion. Here, while imaging, the phone is not held steady, creating a blurry image. And lastly, in this example, hair obscures the lesion. In this case, it's recommended to shave the area first before imaging. If the lesion is flat, such as in this case, it is recommended to shave the area before imaging. However, if the lesion is raised, do not shave it. One quick note for all dermoscopic images. It's important that you do not zoom in on the lesion, as this will not actually increase the quality of the image, and instead it removes the surrounding context. At this point, you can take multiple images of the same spot to help you take the highest quality image. 
Imaging properly can be difficult depending on where it is on your body. It is recommended to also have a friend or family member help with imaging. Here are some imaging tips. Remember to turn on the light. Make sure the Moleskope is fully aligned with your phone's camera. Make sure both your Moleskope lens and the phone camera lens are clean. Make sure you have complete contact with the skin. A high image quality will be clear, in focus, and centered. Next, to submit your spot to your doctor, select the upload icon. Select your doctor and press next. Fill out the lesion history questionnaire. You'll have to fill out this questionnaire every time you make a new submission to your doctor. Depending on the boxes you checked, you'll be asked to provide more information about the lesion. Once an image has been submitted for feedback, it cannot be deleted. After completing all necessary information, close the keyboard and click on Submit. Remember, you must submit each spot individually and are able to repeat the entire process as many times as needed. To make sure your case was submitted to the doctor, check if the upload icon is shown beside each spot. Happy scoping!